A decade prior to the Civil War, there were two major political parties in the United States, Democrats favoring freedom of choice to own slaves and Whigs wanting a big tent party. In Ripon, Wisconsin, anti-slavery activists met on February 28, 1854, then held their first state convention in Jackson, Michigan, July 6, 1854. They named their party Republican with the chief plank being to prohibit those twin relics of barbarism, polygamy and slavery. Abraham Lincoln, the first Republican president, appointed Justice Stephen Field, who wrote in the Supreme Court decision Davis versus Beeson, 1890, bigamy and polygamy are crimes by the laws of all civilized and Christian countries. They destroy the purity of the marriage relation, degrade women and debase men. There have been sects which denied that there should be any marriage tie and advocate promiscuous intercourse of the sexes as prompted by the passions of its members. Should a sect of either of these kinds ever find its way into this country, swift punishment would follow. Justice Stephen Field continued, the constitutions of the several states in providing for religious freedom have declared expressly that such freedom shall not be construed to excuse acts of licentiousness.